But I love how things are right now. This the city's just gone pretty stagnant. Like no matter what I do, things aren't gonna get fixed. I've got schooling problems now. What's wrong? Water sh oh sh oh crap. I'm not much of a swear. I was about to say the, but I have a uh, water shortage now. Oh, the pump has run dry. Well, I knew this was coming. I knew this was coming, so um, I should probably take care of that before people start hating me. I'm just trying to find the best spot to build a pump. I might have to delete this bridge. I just kind of built it just cause. <coughs> Excuse me. So these causes buildings and out of money and fires and stuff. I thought there'd be the reason why they're out of the water they're abandoning is because there there's no water. So I'll take out a big loan because I basically need to build an entirely new water pump. And I'll do it right along this uh this right here. Ah, uh, crap. They said building near the coast means that you'll never run out of water here. I just want to make sure I got lots of room here. So there's room here, but okay. So I think this will be this will actually be the good spot. And now I have room at the back to expand my pumps. So let's uh, let's take out some money. How much is this thing? Because I think I just need a regular pump right now. Okay, so just a small loan. I think I'll just hook this up for the time being. This will all be extended to water pipes and stuff. Whatever. This looks like crap, but again, I'll fix it later. And so, these don't start pumping right away. They need to hire people. And then, basically, when, when this starts pumping, I can add more pumps. I can't just move them. That would suck. And I can kind of develop this area here, which will be good for, for more sims and stuff, more tax base. They're, they're not loans in this game. They're, they're called bonds. Yeah, you can email me. Um, I should probably put this in the description or something of this video. Uh, Haljackie at gmail.com. It's pretty, pretty simple. Uh, you can also private message me on boards like Centropolis and SimCity 4 Devotion and what have you. Or, you know, send me a message on YouTube or whatever. I check everything. Okay, so now it's working. And so I have a bit of an excess. So I'll add to that pump uh, as the other ones run dry. And I have enough money for it without taking out a loan because I still need to pay back this loan. So to take out 20... Five thousand dollars cost me about twenty-seven, so about twenty-five hundred dollars in interest. Okay, well I'm gonna be right back. I'm just gonna go grab some water. So just enjoy the city during the night, and I'll be back in just a sec. Why is it that when I come back, there is, uh... <laughs> I come back to this, the broke city. 
I go away for just a minute and it's gone. Yeah, I had a bit of a cough. That's why I needed some more water. I've just been talking a lot. Um, what am I going to do here? I don't want to take out another loan because I just don't want to buy back all that crap. I think what I'll do is I actually will take out a loan, but it'll be enough to pay for the uh, other loan. And that way I just have money to, to stand by and I'll make out the other one. So I'll take out 50 and then use that to pay back this loan. So I'm okay for now. I still only have one loan, but the interest payments are, are a little bit higher. But again, I'm making money from, from exports and stuff. If I didn't have that, I'd be kind of screwed. I'd have to increase the tax rate even more. Like, where's my, where's my tax right now? Like, I really don't want to go higher than this. 7% for rich people. Once you go higher than that, they hate you. And I also found out that uh, once you go past 11%, I think maybe 12 you might be okay. Uh, other, other populations will hate you too. So it basically shows that even though I'm making a $4,200 deficit, I'm making a profit of $1,800 a month due to, the, due to these uh, transactions here. But this month, um, I am not. So there are some months where I make money and some months where I don't. But running at about a $4,000 deficit, it looks like I'm pretty even. And I also have the bond payment. It's not much though, it's $347 an hour. I uh, turn off one of the expensive buildings. I basically have turned off things that I don't need. Um, water pump is dry. I guess I can turn off the water pumps that aren't working, right? I just wish it told me which, like, if I click this, it shows that I am pumping water, but not all of them. I guess I can just see, turn it off, okay. So this works when I turn it on and off, but this one is underneath some water, so if I turn this one off, yeah, okay, there's an excess. So let's turn that back on. So I can, I can turn off this one because it's dry. This one, I think I can turn off. Nope, this one's still pumping a little bit. So I need to keep that running. Is it? Let's turn this back on. No, I just think I'm at a deficit right now. So I can turn off these two. This one I think might have run dry or it's very close to it. I just wish it told you. Nope, this one's still running because it went from minus 33 to minus 30. Okay, so these two have run dry so I can turn them off until the water table's replenished or just, del or just destroy them. You know what, I'll just destroy them because that way I can get stuff to develop and pay taxes. So what's in demand here? A lot of demand for rich housing. Oh, I don't even need to rezone. Okay, so there's some room here. How's my landfill? It's going good. Just checking here. I understand why Hell Jackie meant by not trying to see the game as SimCity 5. He's totally right. Well, I'm glad you uh, understand that. Um, I don't know if you speak proper English. It sounds like a foreigner. Oh, I'm sorry if I sound foreign to you. I'm really not that foreign if you consider yourself an American and I'm just above you. We pretty much have similar accents. And of course, yeah, we, we have French-Canadian accents too. I'm broke again! Not too happy about that. At least I'm staying alive.
but I just don't want to take out any more blones. It's not good for your approval rating when you keep running, you know, keep going bankrupt. Um, I am exporting coal. You know what? I'm going to increase taxes to 12. At least temporarily. I know I said that for 11. We need money now! Well, there's your problem. What makes me happy? Shopping is good and you need money. So it's like this person ran into like credit card debt or something. <laughs> they can't pay their bills. And this deficit, it's, it's small, but it's still enough to worry about. So basically any profits that I'm making now will be used to, to pay back the, the uh, bond and for a new water pump. I'm on the plus side because I raise taxes. And I, you know, of course nobody likes it when you raise taxes. Everything has an effect in this game. That's what they designed it for. Everybody wants money. But look at these nice buildings. This city may be broke, but at least we got nice buildings. And it looks like there's actually... During the uh, development beta, a lot of these balconies uh, didn't have bottoms. So it's like you had like the... Uh, the railing and everything, but there was no um, actual area to step outside. So yeah, I got a lot of rich people and my taxes are low in rich people. So if I started taxing the rich like they should be taxed, I would be fine. However, they wouldn't like it and would move out. This is kind of a cool little logo here. Is it like a dragon or it's supposed to be like an island or something? All these cars disappearing when they turn into the alleyway. Random patch of grass here. These buildings aren't fully built out, like to the maximum density. It'd be nice to build, like, you know, a pedestrian pathway or something in the middle with, like, fountains and picnic tables and just a place to gather. Kind of like, you know, over here, right? but just have it extend right through as like a pedestrian mall, but if I were to drag like a road through it, it would demolish development on both sides. Like even if I chose a dirt road, right? Like even though the road itself can fit, it would demolish stuff on every side. All right, so I have a, I really need to solve this water problem. So let's build maybe here. 1390, 1395, 13, okay. So now I'm making um, enough water to supply my city. I'm sure, oh, I can destroy this one too. Does this one run dry? So we turn it off. Nope, this one's still pumping a little bit. So I'll keep it, I'll keep it on. And because the pumps are gone, I can get some new buildings. And of course, it's right next to the dump, so the land value's low. Your city is broke but has a lot